The story of Dick Donkey's Dawn. Hi there, we are Dick, Don, and Donkey. Did you interrupt? Dick, Donkey, and Don Brown spent their early childhood together. The two brothers and one sister were separated shortly after witnessing the grisly death of their pet cat, Fluffy. Later in life, they met again and so attempted to piece together their early experiences, particularly those revolving around the death of Fluffy. And you know what? It was fucking fantastic. In 1997, irreconcilable personal differences led to the formation of the band, Dick Donkey's Dawn, which was to function as a cathartic uncovering of the suppressed trauma of their collective past. This honeymoon period resulted in their first concerts in Norway, Germany and Austria. What do you guys feel about uh, tonight's show? What's cool? What's cool? It's violent, huh? That's all I have to say. At this time, they used various devices in their performances. For instance, performing behind glass or without underwear. After these concerts, Dick, Donkey and Dawn withdrew to their respective solo projects. In 1998, Dick, Donkey and Dawn were persuaded to come out of retirement and perform again in Germany. They wrote rehearsed and performed an entirely new set of songs in less than one week. The rehearsal and recording took place amid scenes of increasing uncleanliness and tension between the band members. Their first concert after their relaunch during the Berlin Art Fair in 1998 was at the Bureau Friedrich. Their decision to perform whilst high on LSD was ill-judged, but fortunately, during the performance, most of the audience was still outside the venue. Dick, Donkey and Dawn were to perform for the last time in December 1998 at the Technical University in Graz, Austria. Around this time in Vienna, they also filmed the 3D video for their Boone and Mills Mistaking Sex song. Spiraling drug abuse and the collapse of their record contract led to the project being ill-temperately abandoned halfway through. However, emergency counseling resulted in the completion of filming. Shortly afterwards, Donkey was admitted to hospital suffering from a mystery knee injury. And it was left to Dick and Don to finish the editing in London. Donkey now works as a lingerie salesman in Vienna and underwent successful surgery on his knee. Don has had a sex change operation and now works in the building trade. Dick is a painter and has been clean for four years. The material on this DVD is a sample of the live and recorded output of Dick Donkey's Dawn. <laughs>